Yeah. Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Connie. Anyways, recruitment is starting tomorrow, and tonight is orientation. I just finished my orientation video and quiz, and I'm going to go to dinner super quickly so that way then I can go to bag pickup and meet with my recruitment group. And I'm so excited. I've been waiting for this moment for ever. But I'm very excited. I have 11 Zooms tomorrow. And I think 11. Maybe 10. I don't know. I have a lot of Zooms. I have 19 Zooms in the next two days. Not to mention my like Zooms for actual class. But yeah. I'm very excited. I'll give you a little OOTD in a moment. But yeah. This is the fit for orientation and bag pickup and oh my god I cannot believe this is starting but yeah and there's 19 houses that I go to the University of Illinois forgot to mention this but I'm a freshman at the University of Illinois we're doing a hybrid schedule so I will have open house and philanthropy or first invite on zoom and then the second weekend of sisterhood and preference then potentially bid day they don't know what that it is gonna look like yet but those are in person so that's very exciting and yeah but i really need to go eat soon because i need to make it over to go to back pickup but i'm gonna show you my outfit all right there's my picture wall here's my blank wall that those clips just kept falling so i still haven't put up my thing yet but yeah and here's a dirty mirror which that's what all the outfits checks will be in my like I don't know why these are so wrinkly, but I put on a belt, have my vans. Let's go, baby. It's just a casual fit because all I'm doing is picking up my bags. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. I have my bag. And now you can see how clearly blank my thing is. Oh well. So I'm going to hang out posters after I finish my chemistry homework. But we got a bag, it has a water bottle pouch, and another pouch, which is nice because then I can put my keys in it. Which we only have one room that's in person. And then we got our two teas, which I haven't really looked at yet. A water bottle. A cute little bag that like you can put pens in. I don't know. If there's a pouch in it. Sticker. Okay, this is super cute. We have hand sanitizer because pandemic. Woohoo. And so by the first two rounds in virtual. So we got a key tag that has like the safe walks and safe rides and non emergency police. So that's important and helpful. So it says Panel and X Sorority Recruitment, University of Illinois. I 2021. I don't know which shirt we're supposed to wear which day. I think this is the one we wear tomorrow. Great question. I should have asked my recruitment counselor this. And then this one on the back it says University of Illinois Panel 2021 Panel and Recruitment. And this says Circle of Sisterhoods. I'm guessing this is the um, philanthropy one because this is the philanthropy that our University of Illinois panel and system as a whole supports like when I donated when I like registered you had to pay a fee and then I like also donated five dollars so that went to this and it's working to get women around the world and girls around the world in education which is a very cool hey y'all it's Connie and we got my sh outfit so shirt is from panel and this is a uh, Irish clada symbol. It's from my pants. Don't know where my earrings are from. Apple Watch. Band is from Amazon. Pure Vita. Friendship bracelet I made. Another friendship bracelet I made. Uh, belts from Target. Hollister. I think mom shorts or something. We got bands. Woohoo! But yeah. Open house day one, baby. Oh, rings. Pure Vita, too. I'm. So excited and so nervous. Woohoo! Okay, here's the final look. I was wearing pajama shorts and fuzzy socks in the end, and then I curled my hair and put it a little half up, and then that was my final eye makeup look. So it does look a little different than that video, but this was some pictures I took of the final look, and I really loved my hair like that. It was very pretty. And this was my setup, so. And here's me just goofing off on the this Zoom. This is where I awkwardly wait, because no one's in my breakout room with me. And so I just wait and chill. Hello! How's it going? 
Okay, round one. It was amazing. I really loved most of the houses. There were only like two houses that I did not vibe with, which means I'm up a creek tomorrow because we have to cut down to 13 from 19, which means I have to cut six houses. And it's now 1130. It's very late and I'm very tired. But overall, day one was an amazing success. I talked to a lot of people from schools right near me and talked to a lot of civil engineers or people who had roommates in civil engineering and that was cool and i now a mascara underneath my eye but overall great day one very excited for day two a little bit nervous that i'm not gonna be able to make cuts after day two but yeah i'm very excited for the rest of the process i think i could definitely find my home so that's exciting good morning i look rough I'm gonna go shower and then it's rush day two. It's like 11.20 in the morning. I woke up at like 10.45, just had a little bit of breakfast and juice, you know. And as you can tell, I still haven't even put my contacts in. I'm exhausted, but very excited for day two. Round start at four, or round start at five, meeting is at four. And yeah, I'm gonna go change this and then I need to get on a chemistry zoom at noon. So like, I need to be really fast. And I have to do my asynchronous math class because I kind of slept through it because it's asynchronous. So, like, I, sleep is more important, you know? Anyways, I also need to make my bed because it needs to be made for recruitment. And I think I'm just going to do Zooms and set up everything up there. So, and I have to do homework at some point today. But overall, I'm doing great. I could not fall asleep last night. I was so anxious about today. Just kept rethinking every single thing that I said. And then I was like, wait, was that correct? And then I wanted to check my notes. And I'm like, dude, you need to sleep. Like, you cannot check your notes right now. You have to sleep. So, woohoo. Doing great. Boom. Super fast update because my roommate is on Zoom. But that one went so long. <coughs> oh my God. Um, my voice is so dark. I'm talking all day. But. I haven't killed my hair today. Day two went so well. I'm trying to rank right now and I'm really struggling. I like have three houses I don't love. And so I need to come up with three more. And there's like four I'm fine dropping, but like I still kind of like them. But I had some houses that I really liked that I didn't expect to like, and some that I thought I would like and didn't like, and that's okay. And it's very hard to figure out this process, but it was so much fun. Can't wait for tomorrow. I figure out like which houses I get called back to at ten thirty. I can get max thirteen. But yeah, we just got pizza. It's what like nine fifteen. It was a good day. It was a lot of fun. I'm like so nervous and not I don't wanna rank. But I have like eighteen whiteboards I would show you, but I don't wanna reveal that information, so but it went really well. I was hoping that my final eight houses would be really bad, but I actually did like some of the houses I didn't think it would like at all, so. But overall, it's been really good and I'm like having so much fun and I cannot wait to do this. Ah. Okay, I just washed my face. I need a bed. Yeah. Just washed my face, ready to go to bed. It's like 11 something at night. Talking to my recruitment counselor, I got through everything. I made my decision, it was very hard, but I did it. Alright, I got my hand on my clip, so. Anyways, I'm very, very tired. Good morning vlog. I just got ready. Or I just got changed. Obviously I've not gotten ready and I still need to cut my hair. But my girls did not stay, but I also didn't put in hairspray, so what was I expecting? Um I find out my house is in like an hour. So that's exciting. But I'm gonna show you like my little stuff, so. Okay, so that the pillow thing, very much a necessity. We got lip balm and lipstick, AirPods, because duh. Computer with all my stickers. My favorite stickers, I'll link the shop. And then my computer stand is actually holding a notebook so I can write on that with my notes. Blanket if I get cold. This is plugged in. Phone charger to plug things into. Dry erase marker and pencil for the dry erase board and notebook and then I'll put my water bottle like my hydro flask there and then maybe like a Gatorade or juice or something just so I have like flavor and then on the 10 minute breaks usually I get snacks so 
this is the setup. And then that is what they see. So they see that. But yeah. And then we got the stool. Because otherwise I cannot get up onto said bed. But I'm going to do my makeup and get ready. Because I have to meet with my recruitment counselor in like 40 minutes. Woohoo. I have to meet with my recruitment counselor in 40 minutes. So you got to change this. Because I look a little tired. The lighting is also not great. So you know I just look shiny. But. Anyways, and then the football game's tonight, so that's exciting. But yeah, there's my drawer of all the stuff that I need to now put on my face and my hair. And... Woohoo! Again, put on some the Boppy Fun playlist because, you know, we need some Boppy Funness when we're stressed about houses. I'm not really stressed. I think all the houses that I. I think there's a few houses that I really liked that will take me back. Hopefully, all of them do, but I have no clue. I feel like I might get cut from one or two just because. Like, they have to start making cuts, and we have to start making cuts, and also it'll make it easier if I don't have 13 houses to get to 7. Because 13 to 7 is about half. Woohoo! But I'm having so, like, just so much fun so far. My roommate's about to get back, so I'm gonna stop vlogging, but yeah. Final look. I felt like Aurora. I felt seriously so pretty, and I, like, did a little pink makeup look, and I just loved it. Hello. I'm exhausted. Day one is now done. I finished all, s I can't show seven with one hand. I finished all seven houses. I have three more tomorrow. The three tomorrow aren't ones that I'm like overly excited for, but I'm just tired. I feel like my last few houses weren't as great as I was hoping. The like philanthropies were just, I didn't really have as much of a connection to the th philanthropies. There was one house that I had a great connection with the philanthropy, but then the girls, I didn't have as good of a connection. And then others were like, I had a great connection with the girls and didn't have a connection with the philanthropy. And then some were like, it was kind of just meh. And then there was one house that I really did love. The first day, there was like one girl that I really loved. And I was talking with two girls, one I really loved. The second like didn't really talk much. And then the next girl I talked to, it was kind of just off. And I was like, okay, I'll just go off the vibe of the first girl because I loved her. Like she made it seem like so much fun. But then today, like both the girls that I talked to just kind of were like meh. Like they didn't really match my energy and I don't know. So that was kind of hard, but I'm kind of feeling out of it after today. Like I'm just exhausted and like, you can see like how much, I don't know, my like dark circles are totally popping through because of the rain, like washed off all my makeup or all my face makeup. And I've just like sweat through it and worn through it. And But I'm kind of just exhausted at this point. And I still have three more houses tomorrow and there's a football game tonight, but it's now raining and I don't really know what my plans are for tonight. But I'm ready to just like take a nap, but I can't really take a nap with my eye makeup on so then I'd have to Anyways, I need to like go back through my notes because I'm sure that there were houses that I really loved and it's just been a long day And so I'm forgetting them and I had like a messed up lunch and I also lost my favorite ring I like set it down on my blanket to put lotion on my hands and then I Got up and then forgot it was there and so I don't know where the ring is. So I'm also kind of just pissed but and you go back through my notes because there were some like I remember feeling really good after a few houses today so I need to like go back through because I did really have a good day I just like kind of feel off for whatever reason right now so yeah but uh, I think I'm just really tired at this point but maybe I need to take a nap maybe not I don't know because I want to go to the football game but it's also raining so I don't want to go to the football game but yeah reality of rush kind of just exhausted and feeling like the it's really just the one that I thought was going to be my home didn't end up feeling right uh, like their philanthropy didn't excite me at all which like every philanthropy is a good philanthropy but there's some that like I don't know they have a setup that I just didn't love and it didn't seem like they're as involved as I was hoping and then the girls I talked to just weren't as good as the singular girl so now it's kind of like okay if I only really had a connection with one out of five girls that kind of isn't really a connection but, and I only have to cut three houses and I don't really know which ones I want to cut because I, yeah, it's just hard because like I want to judge it off the sisterhood but I also wanted to have a good philanthropy connection and like one that I'm interested in. And also there is part of me where like there's this one house that I really liked but their philanthropy is kind of very, very serious and I'm not sure if I'm emotionally enough for that. Like, I don't know. I kind of was, there was a different philanthropy that I really liked that like I have a very strong connection to. That isn't as serious, but it's very important, and I really, like, think that it's important because of experiences I've had, but I, like, didn't mesh as well with the sisters, and I don't see it as, like, my future sisterhood, but at the same time, I, like, totally could mesh with the sisters, because 
I've had great combos there, but I don't want to base it just off of what because like I have two main reasons why I'm joining and they're more so focused on the sisterhood elements than they are on the philanthropy elements. So just, I don't know, I just feel like I'm in a hard place right now, but yeah. I didn't go into the football game. It was so much fun. And also the Olympians came from Illinois alumni volleyball gold winners came and so it was so cool to see them but yeah here's a video I took from the football game the entire 2011 team came because one of them was on the 2011 team came and, yeah and then the other Olympian was also there and then I believe it was a coach or someone was a third member of the Olympic group but yeah here's just some clips from the football game it was a lot of fun it was just very wet and gross out Hello, back in the bathroom. Day two. I did not comb my hair today because I uh, tried to pretty straight my ass like this a little bit because it's humid. Same shirt, same necklace, same little earrings. And yeah, we're good. Ooh, I'm done with day two. All right, done with day two of first invite philanthropy. Geez, it's been a long two days, but it went well. Really enjoyed it. The one house did surprise me today. I think I already mentioned that though. The other two houses were kind of just okay, but I still don't know if I found my true home yet. I haven't really figured it out. I'm watching all the house tours right now. These houses are all gorgeous. Some of them are like literal mansions. But yeah, watching the house tours and then going through my notes, I'm going to do a little ranking. I think I know which houses I'm going to cut. Not entirely sure. I need to like go back through everything and like make sure I'm on the right place. Probably going to use a whiteboard and like, you know, map out every thought. Also trying to figure out like which I mean, obviously, sisterhood, like, it all depends on which houses I get back, and then that will depend But for prep. But if I do get back seven houses, um, I do want to, like, do a little bit more of a vibe check and research and everything, just so I have a little bit more of an idea going into sisterhood, just because there are seven houses, and it's going to be a lot to keep track of everything, so I'd rather... Well, there's a possibility of seven houses, so... I want to have like a general ranking going into it, which obviously can change. I've had, like I said, one house today that I didn't like the first and I like today, so we'll see. The storm lighting is beautiful. Oh look, we got my cute posters. It's Tuesday and I can't stop thinking about this, so I'm now wandering all the houses I could have for sisterhood in between my classes. Which it's good because I'm getting exercise, but can't stop thinking about this, so that's fun. Good morning. It's sisterhood. I look rough. You have the hair in a little clip. It needs to get straightened and then curl. And I'm currently about to start doing my makeup. And I don't know how to do my makeup because I'm like wearing a mask. So I don't want to like put on face makeup. But also, I will be taking off my mask today. So I do want to put on face makeup. So, but I also don't want it to just like all end up on the inside of my mask. So, there's that. But I'm so excited. It is so early in the morning. It is like 7.20. I get my alarm went off at 6.45. Got up by 6.50. Like chilled and ate breakfast for a little bit. And like went to the bathroom, washed my face, and now I'm here. And time to do my makeup. Woohoo! I'm leaving. I'm in my dress. It's very pretty. My hair is like in a little twist back, but you can't see because I have my glasses on. Ooh, and then this mask I'm wearing. That's what my friends are to wear. Um, so freaking nervous. I'm, my bag is so heavy because I have so many snacks in it. Woohoo. Hello. It's been a really long day. Happy sisterhood. I got seven houses back, which is amazing, minus the fact that now I need to rank them all and I have no idea what I'm doing. I still have one more house. I really like the last house I was at. It was really good and yeah, I did the same makeup, same like pinky eyeshadow that you cannot see because of the lovely dorm lighting. I should probably try and fix the. Um, this is the dress. Um, here's my stuff, but. Ooh. 
I'm having a lot of fun so far, but also really stressed because I like all the houses and I don't really know which one. None of them feel like my home. That's the issue. They all feel like they could potentially be my home, but I feel like it's a little late in the game for potentially could be my home. I feel like I kind of need the is my home. So woo. So I'm doing great. I'm just really stressed right now because I don't know how the heck I'm supposed to rank seven houses. Like I'm very happy that I got back seven because I mean, that was the most I could get back. It means people liked me, la 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 la. I didn't get back my favorite house that a little rough, but then I just went right into the houses and, and had a lot of fun. Um, some of the houses have taken us on like a full tour. Some of the houses are literally mansions. Some houses have not had great setups. So it's been interesting. I'm very excited for like the process once it keeps going though. Like, I don't know. Sounds like a lot of fun. I'm just really stressed right now. My dress is really pretty. Not like you can see it in the mirror. That's what I look like did the same eyeshadow. I'm doing lovely. Like, I'm seriously so freaking stressed right now. Final house in like 30 minutes, 40 minutes. It was a long day. Preference. I got the fit minus the shoes because I'm wearing tacos and I am so incredibly nervous. Like, so scared. But very excited, but really, really, really scared. So, yeah. Let's hope I get my houses back. Here's me preferencing. Woo! Hello, can you tell I'm like super stressed right now? <laughs> um, I, yeah, wow. I'm currently watching the VMAs because I'm trying to chill out and it's not helping at all. But yeah, I'm watching the VMAs, hoping that it's going to de-stress me, and instead now I'm even more freaked out. I'm also literally staring at my Olivia Rodrigo prom invitation right now, and freaking out because she just won a VMA, and she invited me to prom. Woo. Woo, best pop. Willow, good for you. Ah, uh, Justin Bieber. Mm. I kind of was thinking he would win at least one. Why does it look like Melania Trump is sitting behind him? Big day fit. We got a tiny tank top, jean shorts, and this is going to disappear. I'm gonna go put it in my bed, in my dorm room. Happy bid day, I'm super stressed and scared. Woo! I can't wait. never ended the vlog. Oops. But bid day was so much fun. I had the best day. I loved running, minus the fact that it was a mile. But I will insert pictures and I was in videos. I'm literally like the first one. I had so much fun running home. It was the best. And I have been in the story for a while now and I love it. I actually have initiation coming up and I just did Big Little, edited that vlog, almost wanted to cry. And I think I'm going to try and vlog initiation week just because we have a bunch of other stuff going on. And it's red, Taylor's version really, so like, yeah. But this is the end of the vlog. I had so much fun. If you have any questions about sorority life or stories at UIUC or Rush or anything at all, let me know. Bye guys. Love you.